Hey friends, Lefty Ware here, talking to you about oil pulling. Oil pulling is something that's been popularized over the last, I think, five to seven years. It's something that's been used in area veterinary medicine or Indian medicine for thousands of years. Oil pulling is a very, very simple process of where you're taking either coconut, sesame, or olive oil, and actually, as it says, pulling through your teeth as if you're sucking through your teeth for about 10 to 15 minutes. Now, why do people do this? What's the importance of actually doing this? It's been shown to actually help with gingivitis, help with plaque buildup, as well as um, balancing out the pH of your actual mouth. You gotta re remember that when you're eating something, your mouth has different enzymes inside of it that actually the food is broken down with at first. So, so your saliva and things of that sort is the first digestive enzymes that your food uh, is, is, is being introduced to to help break it down. If you're a, a bacteria, low or even if your ph of your mouth is off you won't break that food down efficiently so this this, this oil pool has been shown to actually help balance that and actually help you digest your food because it's been shown to to really improve the gut microbiome as well over a long period of time so stu some studies have show that actually by you oil pooling five to ten minutes um, per day either in the morning or even at night it's been shown to actually help the most common you know overgrown bacteria inside your mouth which is the s mutant and actually it's been shown to also, as I said before, help with cavities and help with gingivitis. The reason why it's helping with gingivitis is because again, a lot of the, the, those you know, bacteria that's down inside of your gum line is not able to be sucked out and pulled out just by brushing or even swishing with uh, like a Listerine or a different mouthwash. So this oil pulling has been shown to, to really help improve the health of your gums and also the teeth itself. Um, in some studies, is one study that was done I think the study was actually done, uh, uh, I'm sorry to put the, the blank out, but it was done, I think I'm trying to get the date, 2016, where it was just showing the, 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 the effects of uh, gum sensitivity and actually um, doing oil pull and it's been, um, have some great you know, uh, effects with that. Has there been any side effects with, gum, uh, with oil pulling? Not at all. You know, the way you do the oil pull, as I said, you actually are going to measure out about one tablespoon, or I'm sorry, one teaspoon of oil, sesame oil, olive oil, or uh, coconut oil. The most two, the two most common ones are the sesame oil and the olive oil, uh, the coconut oil, excuse me, to actually use. Traditionally, people use sesame oil because it's, um, they call it the, the queen of all oils because it has a lot of um, healing properties. Some individuals actually put either a, a, a little drop of essential oil, of tea tree oil, or, or, or peppermint oil inside there, or even um, you, you lift this oil inside, inside the oil itself to actually help the bacteria and the fungal uh, um, effects as well. But coconut oil and sesame oil has been shown to actually have great antibacterial and also antifungal effects. One reason why is pulling out a lot of that bad bacteria and you don't swallow it after you swish around for 10 to 15 minutes. You spit it out and then after you, after you finish doing that, you want to rinse your mouth out with a little bit of salt water. And not just plain water, just salt water because it helps actually, you know, if you detox your body, you want to get all of the toxins out of your mouth and that actually helps get it out a lot faster as well, guys. So if you do that once, and I actually have some of my patients do it twice a day, if they have really bad breath and actually have really bad, you know, gut uh, microbiome and, 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 and they have the bleeding gums, things like that, so I have them do it at least twice a day for two weeks. And then I tell them just do it once a week forever and you will see the actual benefits. I myself do it. And I've seen myself actually have plaque come out of, you know, after I floss my teeth, my plaque would actually come like this flying off, you know, after doing it for a few weeks. So guys, it's a great thing to do. Please try it out. You'll see the benefits. Talk to you very soon.